In this experiment, you'll study the ideal gas law and its consequences using a sealed plastic syringe with a plunger. The syringe contains a tiny thermistor, which can be measured using this thermistor sensor, which you can connect to Data Studio. A pressure sensor can be attached to this valve using this plastic connector. Data Studio can now record the pressure and temperature versus time for the gas inside the syringe. For the first experiment, we'll compress the gas isothermically. To accomplish this, you compress the plunger slowly so that the gas inside stays roughly at the same temperature as the room. By zooming in, you can maintain the temperature more closely. As long as you keep it within a degree or two, it should be fine. Read the final volume from the lower ring on the plunger. This was the initial volume we started at. For the second experiment, we compress the gas adiabatically. That is, we do it very quickly so that the gas doesn't have time to exchange any heat with the air in the room. The initial and final volumes are the same as for the isothermic case. And here we see the initial and final temperature and pressure. Finally, we study a process that occurs at constant volume. This happens after we compress the gas adiabatically and hold the plunger down. The gas is initially at a higher temperature and then slowly equalizes with the temperature of the air in the room, while the pressure changes accordingly. 